Ma, president of the PAC and struggle icon Mamandi Samagwetu. Let's uh, get more on the story. We're joined now via Zoom by PAC spokesperson uh, Jackie Siroke. A very good day to you and thank you so much for making the time. Uh, our condolences to the PAC. Yes, thank you for having us. And uh, sadly, uh, we seem to be losing our icons on a regular basis. This is, this is said in the PAC fraternity. Yeah, I suppose it's to the PAC and the family. But just uh, uh, give us a sense of who Mamandisa was and her work in the fight against apartheid. She was uh, uh, trained as a, as a health worker, as a nurse. And she has um, done this work largely in the rural communities. Hers is a... A, a tragic uh, love story. She met with uh, Ndade Magwetu when um, uh, the comrade leader was um, banned and restricted to Libod in the former Transkai. His restrictions meant that uh, no people were supposed to, to meet up with him and uh, uh, he was regarded as a terrorist and, and, and isolated from interacting with the community. As you know, the, 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 the banning orders were very restrictive. However, uh, love blossomed and the two of them uh, managed to meet under those circumstances and started a, 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 a good relationship uh, in, the, in the early 70s. Um, she, she, she did work, the underground work of the PAC on behalf of her husband, uh, interacted with the with the guerrillas and, and some of the leaders in the underground of the PAC, and she she interacted also with the the, the women leaders of the PAC, including Mam Zondeni, Sobukwe, Mam Tupeng, and others like that. She crisscrossed the country, going to exile and doing this um, uh, courier work. She. Um, like most of the leaders uh, of that caliber, did not want attention on herself. She regarded herself as a, a, a person who served the African people and did not want uh, focus to be on her personality. And she, re she regarded her, her work as private. We found that this type of leaders um, are little known by the, by the public. But those of us who know their contribution uh, and their heroic efforts do understand that their efforts were, were, were greater than what is known. What significance is the party giving to people like Omar Mandisa whose contribution is not necessarily publicly known? Um, we, we, we obviously um, internally in the PAC discuss this a lot, but what we uh, are, are aiming to do is to highlight uh, the, the valiant work of these uh, heroines uh, in particular. We, we always associate um, uh, their, their, their activities as individuals, not under the shadow of their husbands, and, and highlight uh, the, the amount of work they've done, the risks they've taken, and the contributions to, to nation building uh, uh, that they have made. We, we, we obviously need um, uh, ro good role models for younger people. And because uh, such leaders as Mam, uh, Mandisa Makwetu, uh, the roles that they've played are little known. So we, we discuss their, 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 their activities um, and, and make um, uh, party members and followers to know what, what they did. We... We are happy and, and glad that uh, the issue of um, uh, gender parity and, and the role of women is now being highlighted. So we do that under the guise of uh, uh, that understanding. Which is a very important conversation. Uh, are you able to tell us how you're going to take it forward? Um, uh, at the moment, with Mam Mama Kwetu, uh, the family is arranging um, uh, uh, funeral uh, for the funeral uh, and also for announcement, there's a um, there's a way in which uh, the, the the family would like to undertake this, and so are giving them that respect. They have given us um, uh, the, the 
the right or the, the, the we have an agreement with them to make the announcement and work closely with them. Um, when it comes to um, uh, highlighting some of our our heroes, we have a we have a program and we use all platforms, uh, including digital platforms, uh, to make our heroes known. We write our history. We have um, established an archive. Um, of the PAC, where this information is readily available for researchers, for journalists, and, and for the public at large. Are you able to tell us who the surviving members are of the family? Yes, they have uh, two uh, wonderful sons uh, who are uh, uh, in themselves uh, great with um, uh, agricultural work. They are, they are, they are farmers. But they are too as a was a was related to the land, the son of the soil. So they've taken up that task and are, are, are doing wonderful work uh, in, in, in that area. We are sad that um, this tragedy is happening to the Makwetis. Not long ago, their nephew, who was the Auditor General, passed on. So it's, it's, it's really a, a sad moment, and we, we would like to pass condolences to the family. Oh, it's interesting that there's that link, but I'm more interested in the part where you say the sons are involved in agriculture, which kind of makes sense, because for years this has been the central message of the PAC, hasn't it? Yes. Um, look, I mean, we, we do have people who have uh, interest in agriculture. Um, our comrade uh, leader, Tatem Makwetu, um, had a farm in the Kofinvaba district and um, his, his relationship um, with um, uh, had a, a cattle ranch and um, uh, specialized grooming the young uh, the two young young men into this they are now on their own very great uh, business people uh, and are, are taken in, in great regard in agricultural sectors um when do you think you will have the details of the funeral um, we will consult with the family and, and, and make um, a public announcement as soon as possible. Um, we think it, it wouldn't really take long because the, the family um, uh, is now consulting as we speak. And thank you so much. We hope you will give us that update. Uh, but just because we have the opportunity to speak to you now, how is the PAC engaging with the conversation uh, that was started by mm. last week by uh, uh, Land and Agricultural Minister Togoti Diza and the Justice Minister Ronald Lamola about a land, co land court. All right, we seem to not have that connection anymore, but uh, it's a conversation we hope to have at another time with Jaggi Siroke of the PAC and uh, talking about the passing of Mrs. Magwetu. Let's take